The next step in getting your home sold as a first time home seller. So your house has been shown to multiple people and now you have an offer. What happens? So when your agent receives that offer from the other agent or from a non-represented buyer, whatever the case may be, they are required to present you every single offer that comes through. Rather, they know you like it or you're not gonna like it. It is their responsibility to present it to you. When presenting you the offer, they should show you all the important parts of the offer and explain it in detail what it means for you and provide you what's called a net sheet. A net sheet basically shows you what your expenses will be minus what your payoff is to show you how much money you may net at the end of that sale. Once you've received those offers and those net sheets, you can then determine if there is one that you're interested in accepting. If there's something that you want to change on that offer, it then becomes a counter offer. As a counter offer, the buyer has the option to walk away. So depending on what that change may be, make sure you discuss it in full what repercussions could come from countering an offer. Usually the rule of thumb is you can go back and forth one to two times. If you can't become on terms after one to two times, you probably won't come to terms at all. Hopefully you have a good understanding and explanation of the offer so that you can make the best decisions for you when selling your home.